I want to use this video to talk a little bit about uh, using your Mac virtual display and the different uh, resolutions you can use and what it really looks like and kind of how you can work with it day to day. So this is default right here. And if I show you in the settings, we've got our displays and you can see we are at 2560 by 1440, which is default. In this mode, I mean, I can see perfectly clearly all this small text, super easy. Uh, I have two screens here side by side, which is great. I can make it super big, as big as I need, right? Like I, I don't want it that big. I can barely see the whole screen of my vision, but something like that, perfect. I can even move it just right here. Great, right? But let's get a little bit higher with the resolution. So if you do all resolutions right here, we can actually go all the way up to 5120 by 2880. And look at this. I mean, this requires a bit of window management, I would say, because right now I actually can read this, but it's pretty small. Like I would have to zoom in a little bit. Now I can read this just fine. Uh, but you know, you can start to see how you would have a lot of different windows open and you can kind of make it work if you have a workflow with a bunch of apps that aren't on Vision Pro, like Final Cut or Logic, and you want to run a lot of things together. You can kind of do it. I'll say the refresh rate goes down a little bit. It's a tiny bit laggy, but it's really not that bad. You just got to zoom in a little bit, just pulling up a new site right here. So would I want to work in this every day? I don't think so, but maybe some people can kind of find a way to make this work for them. I'm going to go back to, well, between these two is the 3840 by 2160. So that's what this looks like. So this is actually a little bit more useful. I use this magnet app to uh, change my windows here. I forget, uh, all right, right third, there we go. So you can have a few windows up this way as well. Uh, again, though, I can see why Apple def defaulted to the 2560 by 1440. I mean, this just looks normal, very clear. It's kind of how I would want to use it day to day. Uh, but let me know if you have any other questions about Mac display mirroring.